Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to Father Glock. It is the morning of day 23. I've got a few skill points to spend before we get started here. So I'm gonna go over to Perks and throw the first one into Coil Gun Crafting 2. Then I'm gonna go Titanium Crafting 1. And then I'm gonna go over to Scientist and do Demolitions Expert 2. And yeah, Science 3. All right, let's get some uh, repair and upgrading work done to the church. I still got to replace all the hatches in the hatch hallway. We'll get that done eventually. This morning, though, I want to focus just on getting uh, as much of the floor upgraded to steel as I can and do a little bit more upgrading to the cobblestone blocks as well. And then we're going to go see Trader Hugh take on one of those tier five jobs. Oh, why did the Kennys cross the road? Who cares? Fuck you, Kennys. What's up, Hugh? I'm looking for some work, preferably a fetch quest. And you only got one, so that's what I'm gonna take. That'll be easier than a fetch clear, especially in a tier five POI. This is uh, quite a ways away to the south, so that should be in the snow biome, which is good because snow biome is where you find lead, and I need some lead. see what we got lead nice all right let's do some digging and a bit of mining and then we'll continue on to the south and do this job for you got a wolf come on in buddy oh what was that would you bite me with your butt cheeks I hear your feet crunching in the snow you're not being sneaky there you are. Come on down here, Thick. Stop playing games. Oh, you brought a friend, did you? Whoops. All right, she's dead. You gonna come now? Here, let me help you out. You're welcome. Oh, that's not good. That is a screamer. Man, I should have brought the auger. I didn't because I figured it would attract screamers, and we got one anyway. Come on. There we go. Get out of here. Where's she at? There she is. What were you doing down there, huh? Trying to cut my brake lines, you trifling bitch? Well, looks like we're in the clear. Got uh, almost a full stack of lead. I'm happy with that. Let's throw some stuff in the car. Get the hell out of here. Well, well, well. The Hotel of Death. Really, it's an apartment building, but Hotel of Death sounds so much better, so fuck you. One round of 9mm. That's a nice find. Oh, this is all new and different already. Hey, Mr. Officer, rough night. Dead. And we're starting off with some uh, decent loot here. I like that. Okay. Nice. I mean, really what I'm on the lookout for, as you all know, is uh, hazmat material or hazmat suit pieces. Uh, but on top of that, I also want electrical parts and plastic parts. So I'm gonna be taking apart computers and TVs to get those. Uh, some appliances also. There's a lot of appliances in this place though. I'm not gonna go overboard and take apart every fucking fridge in this place, but, you know, we'll get some. We'll leave here with a bunch of parts, that's for sure. Get out of here. Uh, one thing to note, which someone brought to my attention, uh, oh, this is locked, which I thought was interesting, is we, we don't need to scrap the, um, hold on, there's gotta be dogs around here. Yep, 
No oh, shit. Yeah, bitch. Here come his friends. Oh, what? I can't be stopped. Um, the hazmat jacket and the pants replace our jacket and our pants. They don't replace armor pieces. So, if we find the jacket or the pants, we shouldn't scrap them. We should hold on to them. One round of 762 and some steel crossbow bolts. I'll take the bolts for now. Uh, we could always scrap them if we want to get rid of them. There are more bolts. That's fine. What the hell is going on in here? A little storage room. Oh, well, we can take apart this stuff. Scrap that, take everything else, and there's a weapons bag in here. How many hit points does this have? Only a thousand? Not a problem. Now we can squeeze on in there. Sweet. There's a ladder going up to what? Let's see. Oh, this is like the first story of the hotel. Uh, I'm not going to go that way. There are stairs we can take, plus there's stuff down here I haven't searched yet, and there's still zombies around that I want to kill. Oh, spider zombie! Here we go, they're all waking up now! Trying to be stealthy with this sword. That didn't work. What? Where'd that little fucking spider monkey go? Ah, oh, there he is. Come on now. Yeah, not the best start. Getting my ass kicked in the parking garage. That, that, that's a rough outlook for how the rest of this POI is going to go. Oh, we got a hatch going down and a backpack. Let's check this. Pink dye, I'm good. We gotta see what's going on down here. This is all new for sure. Oh. Alright. Get out of here, bitch. We got the sewers down here. That's all barred off. Everything is barred off. I wonder how we get over there. Is that something we explore later? Well, the bars only have a thousand hit points. Let's explore it now. It's another spider zombie. I think that's above us though. No, it's right here. Ooh, red loot bag. Not bad. Take all that. Got a ladder going up right here. Oh, I'll take the lead. We already got a bunch of it. Why not take more? Oh, get out of here. Oh, this is the parking garage. Duh. Totally missed that. Uh, I'll take that. Don't need those boots. All right. So what do we got around here? There's another ladder going up, and I guess that's it. Another little control room. Okay. Let's take this stuff apart, and let's finally get into the hotel. Here we are. Oh, man, this is all new also. Should be fun. I guess that's the way to go. Let's see. This should be a laundry room. Yep. So that's the same. Scrap the brass, take the gunpowder. Good on that sandwich. And uh, let's get started then. Got uh, Kenny at the window over there. That's clear. I'm coming for you, Kenny. Just hold on. Nothing there. Fuck you, glue. Fifty-four rounds. There's always nine millimeter in the toilets in Darkness Falls. Come on out of there, boy. Nice. I'll take both of those things. Oh, he's one of the tough guys with the black smoke. 
probably maybe use a gun on him. Shoot him in the ass a few times, soften him up. Oh, shit. Come on then, bitch. The sword just works so much better. It really does. A wheel? Alright, I'll take it for now. Dump it if we get too uh, encumbered. Hop seed recipe. I'm going to scrap that for the yellow paper because I don't really need that. You know, I'm not starting a garden. As much as people say you need to start a garden in Darkness Falls, I don't find that at all. I'm overrun with food. Why would I start a garden? It's just a waste of time. I could spend that time hunting. I don't even need to hunt. Look, the meat comes to me. Get out of here, Kenny. Nice. Bunch of ammo. Double barrel shotgun that we don't really need, but I can sell it. We got a zombie, yeah, at this door right here. Nothing there. That's clear. Mm, I'll take the glasses for now. Wake up time. Oh, son of a bitch. Wake up time. Oh, fuck. Ah. Uh. Back up. Oh. Yeah, see, I, I might as well just use the sword. I don't know why I even brought the shotgun and the pistol. I mean, the pistol's nice for range. Oh, oh well, that was just bodies decaying. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I probably should have brought uh, a bow or, um, or a crossbow instead of the pistol. At least I could be silent with those things. The pistol is nice for range, but then it just fucking wakes everyone up. Oh, they broke through. Let's get up here. This might be tricky for them. The bikers figured it out. Come on. Dead. What are they stuck on? They're just beating the wall for no reason. Out of here, lady. All right. Bunch of zombies here at this door. Fuck off. I think they might have came from outside. Well, maybe not. He was the black smoking zombie. Oh, no, he wasn't. Black smoking zombie is behind this door. All right, then. Let's have at it. It's a spider zombie. Dead. All right, so the shotgun isn't completely useless. Nice little grab right there. You know, I don't think I have a bandolier mod on my chest armor. I don't. We should probably put that on. Even if it's just for this POI, since we have two guns that reload kind of slowly. Let's replace this with it. There we go. Oh yeah, that's a little better. Oh, I'm pretty sure this is the death room. The room where the floor gives out and sends you into a room full of zombies with no way out. Uh, I'm not too worried about it, though, because our character is tough as shit, and I've got a laser ninja sword. Oh, here, let's see if we can make the floor give out. Oh, get out of my way, lady. There it goes. This is another room that's going to be full of zombies. Holy shit. Okay, then. Uh, let's not get cornered. Damn. Shit. Oh, boy. Come on down, then. What are these idiots doing? Oh, look, this is the death room. Might as well pop it open. Yep. Yeah. Here are all the zombies. Fuck it. No! Oh, that shotgun ain't doing shit. Just bouncing off their helmets. Damn. All those other zombies are still up on the second floor. Here they come. Now it's a party. We got some tough zombies in the crowd. You can see the black smoke coming off of them. 
We're fine, though. I mean, look, I got, like, fucking <laughs> full health. Oh, I got an abrasion now. And we're infected. Dead. 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 Man, even with a sloppy performance like that, health is damn near full. I'll take this honey, which cleared up the infection. Nice. Let's take a vitamin so we don't get infected again. And let's use a bandage to get rid of that abrasion. Nice. Man, I probably should have stopped at the car while we were outside and unloaded. I think we're clear in here. Oh. Now maybe we're clear. I'm good on that stuff. Let's take this TV apart, though. I'll tell you, we're going to leave here with plenty of plastic and electrical parts, which is good. Still no uh, hazmat material or anything like that, but what are you going to do? We'll get it eventually. Well, that's waking everyone up. Oh, this might be a good spot right here. Fuck off. <laughs> Dumbasses. Oh, that's great. See you later, Mo. Eh, whatever. We'll get him on the way back down. Oh, missed one. Dead. Let's pop this closet open. Not with the grenade. I tell you, if I'm going to die in this hotel, that's how it's going to happen. I'm going to accidentally drop the pulse grenade and kill myself. I don't know why I brought the thing. I've been dying to try it. Um, but I've gotten warnings about it, and how much damage it does, and the radius of the explosion. Like, you could easily kill yourself with one of these things. So, yeah, we gotta be responsible. Maybe, maybe on the rooftop. We'll see how it goes. Whoops. Whoops. Yeah, using the crowbar to unlock wooden doors... Leaves you a little vulnerable, because it just completely obliterates the door. I should have uh, hit it with something lighter than the crowbar. It would have unlocked it and kept it intact, so we could, you know, slam it in the zombie's face if we need to. One of those days, lady? Oh, there's poopy in there. Gross. And that's how you get the drop on some zombies. Surprise, bitch! Yeah, well, your smoke gave you away. Oh, shit. Oh, should have reloaded this thing. So much for getting the drop on them. Oh, damn it. Here they come. Dead. Oh, my God. How many of you fucks were in there? Okay, that's nice. Man, even with scrapping a lot of the bullshit, we're going to be encumbered soon. Whoa, boy. Well, that's new. Um, This should all be cleared. It is. This is the way we got to go. Through here. Yeah. Clear. I'm good on that stuff. Taking us outside. Definitely taking longer than normal. I mean, I've cleared this whole POI in a day before. But, uh, you know, I've been taking apart everything and kind of taking my time here. So it's uh, definitely taking longer than normal. Obviously, I don't know what time it is, so I couldn't tell you. But there's definitely a possibility we roll over tonight while doing this. 
The, um, the supplies we need to fetch are still above us. Uh, but even if I grab them now, I would still continue on upward to the main stash. I mean, we gotta finish this POI. There's no way I'm leaving it without the, uh, the main loot. We're gonna wake everyone up in here. Yep, here we go. Let's open this door. Locked, shit! <laughs> I should have known it was gonna be locked. Every fucking door is locked in Darkness Falls. Back down. I'll just uh, run circles around this uh, this little ramp right here, and we should be fine. Dead. Dead. Looting while fighting. It's a sign of someone who just doesn't give a shit anymore. Two more wheels. That's three wheels we've found today so far. No fucking hazmat material, though. Ah, the burnt area of the building. We're getting close. After this is the construction area, and then we should be at the rooftop in no time. Burnt zombies are so easy to deal with. Um, you would think they would be a little tougher and maybe set you on fire if you got too close to them, but really they just look cool, and that's about it. Might get a little crazy in here. I'm expecting a ton of construction zombies. Let's see. This will probably wake them all up. Oh, that's going to be a problem. Here they come. Oh, shit. I'm stuck. I'm stuck on something. Fuck. Not good. Get out of my way. Oh, that was almost really bad. I mean, it still is kind of really bad. Will you all fuck off? I'm trying not to fall off of the ledge here. There we go. Oh, loot bag fell. I'm not going to get that, though. Not right now, anyway. All right, that construction area was not as bad as I thought it was going to be. I think we're pretty much there. Just go up to the roof. Or this is the roof. What is this? This is all new. Oh, this is this is like uh, the lower part of the rooftop. It's just changed a bunch. Cause now I'm remembering you go you go out on the roof, and then you go up uh, fire escape back into the building for a little bit. And then up to the main part of the roof. Mechanical parts. We got some black smoke over there. Come here, bird. Dead. Hey, this might be the perfect time to test out the pulse grenade. Let's um, not go this way. Maybe from over here. Yeah, that zombie's over in the corner there, so... And it's one of the tough zombies. So let's see what happens here. Hopefully I'm far enough away. Holy shit! Get out of here, bird! Did I kill him? I did kill him! Damn! Whoop! Back up! It electrocuted him, too. That's fucking cool. I don't know if we can use that in the base, though, during Horde Night. Oh, let's take all this shit apart for electrical parts. I mean, maybe when they're just about to break through the hatch hallway, when they have like one or two hatches left, we could back all the way up in the main room to like underneath the Father Glock sign. And that should be enough room for us to use the pulse grenades. Other than that, we would just be risking um, our own life using them. Well, it's officially night. Not that that changes anything. It's just we've been here pretty much all day. It is what it is. I'm not going to stop now. Looks like the supplies are on this level. Probably in this apartment. 
So let's keep an eye out for them after we deal with all these fuckers. There we go, supplies in hand. We're almost encumbered, but we're also almost at the end here. All right, this is it. The final floor before the roof. Certainly got some zombies in here. Door's locked. So is the bathroom. Let's pop these open. There's nothing in there. Oh, oh shit. She's a fireball shooter. Die, bitch. Yes. Oh, hopefully we don't have any more of those. That was good. We got her killed, though. Holy shit. A lot of fucking zombies. If I was dealing with, uh... Fireballs and all of these zombies, that would not be a fun time. So I guess that's good. We got her killed first. Dead. Mmm, dead. Oh, this is a tough one. Get the shoddy out. Down he goes. All right. Not bad. That worked out. Definitely could have gone worse. Oh, this is different. All right, well, let's do some stupid shit. No oh, shit, close that door. That door is not gonna hold. Fuck! Come on! Oh shit, fireballs. Not good. Oh my god. Um. Whoa, get out of the way, lady. Should have been more prepared for that. Damn! Who the hell are you? Holy shit! She hits hard, huh? Oh my god! Fuck! We gotta go! I'm on fire! I'm getting the shit kicked out of me! By some big giant white woman in a lab coat! Oh, I guess we're going down! That, uh... <laughs> that was not good. Here comes this crazy bitch! Oh, she's a zombie behemoth! dead now. Oh, damn it. I don't know where the fireball shooter is. Oh, is it him? I think it's him. Fuck. We gotta go. 65 health. Shit. Oh, this is a dead end. Oh my god, we're gonna die. Fuck. Oh, I should have brought first aid kits. Out the window. Oh, let's cower here for a moment. Are they coming? Holy shit, that did not go well at all. We got birds out here. I got bandages left. But uh, they don't do much. Let's get hydrated. Uh, painkiller. That helps a little. And you can't just keep taking painkillers. You're limited. You have to like, it's like a cooldown period. Oh! Fuck! Get out of here! Oh shit, they heard me! And they know where we are! Big boy's a fireball shooter! Die, you big son of a bitch! Oh my god, oh no! Oh no! This is it! Fuck! Oh! oh. <laughs> How? How am I still alive? That's why they call me the John McClane of Seven Days to Die, bitch. I can't be stopped. Will you just please die already? Oh, shit. Fuck. All right. I keep going for my inventory for the water, and it's in my hot bar. <sighs> going back in for more, you guys. 
I'm a glutton for punishment. Did I kill them? I think I did. Unless they fell. I don't know where the zombies are now. They could be anywhere. We gotta start making our way back up to the roof, though. Oh, hey, look, that loot bag that fell. Silver lining, right? 31 bucks and some knuckles we would have missed out on if all that shit didn't just happen. Um, I'm just taking the stairs up. Fuck it. Oh, shit. Please don't kill me. Please stop shooting your fireballs at me. I just want to get to the roof and get the loot and then I'll go home. Well, I think they're all below us. So, if we can just, uh... Get to the rooftop. And grab the loot before they catch up. We'll be fine. I think. More money. I like money. I think we're clear. Except for possibly a bird or two. Okay. I think we're good now. What do we got in here? Well, hey there. This is the loot I've been looking for. Nice. We're gonna be, uh... quite encumbered on the way back down. Hopefully we can... avoid all those fucking zombies. Give me some good shit, like a first aid kit. Oh, you know what? We can take, uh... the steroids and we won't be encumbered anymore. That's good, and our melee damage will be pumped up a little bit. Alright, I figured there wasn't going to be anything up here. I mean, they're not going to put two big piles of loot. Well, we did it. We made it. Somehow. Did not get murdered by all those crazy-ass zombies on the roof. And now we got quite... A long drive home. It's the morning of day 24. I mean, it's like 2 in the morning, you know, because my nights are shorter. So we still got plenty of time to get home and get all this loot sorted. And we can pick things up on the mid-morning of day 24. I'll take the fire escapes down. Hey, there's some more loot. Try to avoid any fireballs shooting zombies. Grab these loot bags and get the fuck out of here. Alright, well, that wasn't too bad. I mean, we're alive, so I can't complain. We didn't find any hazmat material or hazmat pieces, though, which kind of sucks. But we did get a ton of electrical parts and plastic parts, so we can make some more coil batteries when we get home. And I'll get all this loot. Uh, put away, figure out what we want to sell out of it, and uh, we'll pick things up, like I said, on the mid-morning of day 24. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I hope you're looking forward to seeing more. Thank you so much for watching and all of the support. It really does mean a lot. You guys can follow me on Instagram or Twitter. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Stick around for more Father Glock, and I will catch you guys in the next episode.